Hi, welcome to Open Amster. Today we'll be taking a look at the Wise Cam Indoor Outdoor Model Version 3. I got a bunch of these a while back. The Pet Co, I think it was, they had on sale. It was like $33. Typically goes for about $35 to $37. And it's just 1080, but I'm using this primarily to wash the dog. I set this up one in the backyard these two wheels will be going to the backyard covering different angles just so I can see who the dog is barking at also set one up in the dining room area now I can watch the kids the main goal had been to set up for a dining room area to see our dog stealing food and because this is a new camera a new setup it qualified for the events I'm trying to find where the events were hmm. oh down here events if I play the if I press the playback that plays things that was stored on the micro SD card that's on the bottom of the unit right here the last time I had a wise cam was to watch the office, and that was the version two. Worked great until it lost the a lot of the AI functions. There's person de detection, vehicle detection. I'm trying to scroll to another one that says pets. Should have it from yesterday. See this one detected person and pet. Uh, the detections is so just okay. This is an, a neat feature. It's not always accurate. Sometimes it identifies the pet as the person not a big deal and turn off notification um, because it's it pops up a lot but you can also create rules so that at night time it would automatically shut off all the alerts this is the power adapter it's universal 100 to 240 volts outputs at 5 volt 1 amp the cameras are very easy to set up that even my kids can do it they did they set up half of them I think this is a very good inexpensive oop I pressed the playback button by accident I think right now wise cam is the perhaps the most budget friendly camera out there whereas the other ones like by more the more expensive brands blink those other ones nest cams they're just too expensive and they require cloud service that's pretty pricey this one i can pay for cloud service which is about 20 dollars a year per camera or record to the micro sd card i think i'll just record a micro sd card for now for the indoors for the outdoors i'll have upload to the cam so this was just a quick overview of the wise cam version 3. it's been out for a while but I finally got around to installing it. If you guys have any questions, comments, suggestions, feel free to contact me. Thanks for watching Awkward Hamster.